Yo, what is up guys, Shinobi EV back again with another video for you guys and today just cuz you know I felt like doing it. I'm like, you know what? I have this queen I have this Shikai Ichigo. It's an ordered unit, you know, so it's not as broken as all the newer units that we're getting right now. But I'm like, you know what, what would be a better time to showcase this Ichigo than right now in Thousand Year Blood War when he is finally back in action. We just saw his get to the GG show. We just saw him literally about to 1v8 the freaking Stern Raiders. And on top of that, we got Chad and Orihime coming back. So, I mean, like, you know what? What's what a better time to showcase this Ichigo than right now, even though it's an older unit? And, I mean, even still, he's still pretty good, in my opinion, because he got the Resurrection. So, he's pretty good, in my opinion, but still older character. So, yeah. But, <laughs> either way, if you guys do enjoy my showcase of this character, please leave a like, subscribe to the channel. We're going to be trying to hit 1,000 subs by the end of the year. Hey, if we can hit a out, better goal will be 1,000 subs by the time it's my next birthday, which would be September 15th. That is my goal right now. That is... That's currently the goal, but hey, if you guys enjoy my content, please leave a like, and you already know what to do down in the comments, but let's go ahead and get straight into this character, because man, even though this character's old, the drip is there, bro. The drip is there, the pose is there, honestly, I kind of wish that the anniversary Ichigo got this kind of drip. I mean, you could, he's he, the anniversary Ichigo's not bad, don't get him started, it's not bad, but like, bro, the pose is there, the nad string is there, like overall, pretty decent there, but let's go ahead get straight into this so we've got devastation decreased damage taken which was on his resurrection uh increased links uh increased speed droplet drops so even though this character is not the best anymore because he is older um he has at least some farm usage so you can use him for farming if you do have him even though there's better characters for it and faster ones but you know he does have in case you need it. he has a long reach flurry weakened defense sprinter and other than that he also has the reduced strong attack cooldown increased strong attack and increased normal attack damage and he, he, like just based on the list alone you could tell this character is old as hell like all the other characters they be having long lists and then this is basically it for him but other than that we got spiritual pressure army as a killer for us spotter which isn't half bad um and overall i mean pretty decent unit in my opinion even though he's old pretty damn decent unit but we're gonna go ahead and take him to the trials and test out how well he does in 2023 let's get it all right and we are back so let's go ahead and take a look at what this ichigo has especially since for me this would be like a refresher because i haven't used this ichigo in forever so let's go ahead and take a look at what we got here so nash string me personally when it like this ichigo got a crazy nash string not the craziest but in terms of like this ichigo versus the anniversary i wish the anniversary got this nash string because the nash string looks so nice but either way, that's pretty much the Nash string for you. Pretty good there. Uh, first strong attack, pretty much a forward attack, which, you know, does some pretty good damage there. Not the best, because once again, each goes old, but hey, we still rock with it. Um, second strong attack, as you saw, pretty much grouped them up. It doesn't follow, unfortunately, like the one that we got in Anniversary. But if you do group them up, this Ichigo can, of course, catch them out and does pretty decent damage right there. So, not bad. And then if we want to go to the full screen, pretty much get Suga GG show. You know, it doesn't really show it in the best manner, but it still looks pretty damn good in my opinion. So, me personally, my whole thing with this Ichigo is his strong attack 1 and his full screen are good. His full screen and his strong attack. It's the second one in my opinion that kind of screws him over a little bit because it doesn't track. So, like, enemies can get around it, and you can still get hit. That's the only thing I have with it. But other than that, this Ichigo, if it was to get a revamp, and they were able to give him some pretty good moves. Give him tracking on his second strong attack. First strong attack, pretty decent. And then give him a better full screen. Overall, this Ichigo would be an absolute monster. But once again, this character is old, so it's to, it's to be expected. But while we're here, like, you know, I wonder what y'all guys' thoughts and opinions are on, you know the new episode that we got recently for you know Ichigo and everything that we got because me personally uh it, it was fire it was straight fire me personally I would prefer that they use the old you know number one theme that they did or even the new remix version uh what do you call it um I wish they had used that but either way it's still pretty damn good not to mention we got to see Chad we got to see Orihime we got like Bro, Ble I don't know about you guys, but when it comes to the big three, Bleach, in my opinion, outside of One Piece, maybe, probably is the best in using their side characters. Because literally everybody got screen time. Like, we got eight Quincy's trying to team up on them. Like, they did a really good job with the Fem Raiders. I love how Kubo basically kind of gave them, like, the magical girl treatment, which was really nice. And it was an added scene as well, so that was nice. But overall, I mean, pretty good damn episode, if I do say so myself. 
pretty damn good episode. And the whole on top of that, you got the parallels with how Ichigo basically saved Kenpachi. Like how Kenpachi saved him when he was going against, you know, Noritora in the wrong card. So you got the parallels with that too. Not to mention, you got to kind of see how Kenpachi in that episode, even though he didn't get to see much of it, you got to see how, like, even Kenpachi was like, he cared a lot about Yashiru. Like, that man cared a lot about Yashiru, and I'm just getting caught up right now. I'm just getting caught up right now. Because <laughs> I'm not paying attention. I'm trying to talk while I'm playing at the same time, and once again, that Ichigo's old. So it's like, I gotta do a lot more, so we're gonna try that again. But overall, I like, hope the episode, you know, was good. But yeah, let me try that again, because I, I'm over here not concentrating. And the thing is, with these older characters, it's like, bruh. <laughs> with these older characters, you gotta be really careful with them, because obviously they're not as strong as the old one, other ones. And me personally, it's just second strong attack. The second strong attack is the only thing, in my opinion, that I'm like, yo, if they had fixed that, if they gave it a, if they made it a vortex, like they did with the anniversary Ichigo, for 8th anniversary, or at least giving it track, and it would have been so much better. It would have been so much better. But let's go ahead and try this again. Let me, let me, let me actually, you know, pay attention to what I'm doing here. But yeah, no. Overall, though, as far as the Bleach episode is concerned, you know, pretty decent, in my opinion. Or not even decent, like, Illustrate Peak. Let's not, let's not even get it twisted. Illustrate a freaking peak. But, other than that, let's go ahead and clear this out. Let me, let me actually try a little bit. Let me pay attention to what I'm doing for once. But yeah. We're looking good here. And also his Nash string, even though like his Nash string is good and everything like that. But even his full screen for some reason, I don't know why, but I just have that feeling for some reason that it could be so much more. Which is why when I, I which is why when we get a reboot of this character, because you already know they're going to reboot this character. When we get a reboot of this character, I really hope that they do this man justice, because you saw it earlier, like, the second strong attack, it literally, like, it just kind of just went by, right by this, it didn't have no tracking, and everything like that, like, we really need to reboot this Ichigo, we really do, like, we need a revamp of this Ichigo right now, and hopefully they release it soon with, like, the anime going out and everything like that, hopefully they release a new revamp of Ichigo, because we really need that. go yeah, it's definitely gonna take me a lot longer to clear this no than normally just because i'm just trying to use ichigo and nothing else but and this ichigo's old once again like i wish the second like this second strong it looks so good but like at least like it could have had a homing why couldn't they give in this ichigo the homing bruh i know like back then it wasn't really common to give homing to some characters and all that stuff but come on All right, let's get that out of the way. Full screen. And I wish the anniversary Ichigo got this Nash string for real though. It'd been crazy if they actually gave him this Nash string. And also, I'm pretty sure this Ichigo doesn't have guard break on him, so that's also another thing. All right, trying. I'm trying to like bottleneck it right now because I don't want them to get around me. <laughs> trying to bottleneck it. <laughs> Alright, keeping it moving. I think this should be the stage. Let's see what the soul bomb is looking like. Because I've never seen this Ichigo soul bomb, so this ought to be interesting. Okay, this is where he goes like True Shikai or Horn of Salvation. I can't wait until they animate this, man. When they animate that, oh lord, it's gonna be nuts. Oh, he actually lived. Alright. Not crazy damage, but it still got the job done. Two it took two soul bombs. It's alright. It's all right, but other than that, I mean, I mean that's pretty much this Ichigo in a nutshell. Not really much else to talk about when it comes to this Ichigo, due to the fact that he's older. Hopefully, we can get a revamp of him. But I mean, other than that, um, we'll see how fast we can move this thing. Though to be honest, I don't think this is gonna be a very fast clear time. I want to see how fast we can get it done before we end this off. But yeah, no, leave me down in the comments. You know, let me know, like. What you guys' thoughts on the new episode is, or Blade Styles and Blow War in general, like Core 1 and Core 2. Like, I want to know you guys' thoughts, because me personally, I feel like this is a test to see for Kubo if we can get more content. So far, we've been, we've been doing good. Like, it's been getting received well, especially in Japan. It's been received really well. It's been received really well on, on in America. Like, when I went on TikTok yesterday, 
I couldn't escape seeing when Ichigo showed up. Like, it was everywhere. It was everywhere, bro. And hell, even on Twitter right now, as we speak, like, bro, Ichigo and Orihime are trending. Especially Orihime, bro. Like, come on. Orihime got that upgrade, for real. That outfit looks crazy. And just imagine when freaking Yorichi gets on screen with that cat form. Oh, it's gonna go crazy. We can't, I can't even wait for Yorichi to come on screen. People thought Orihime was nuts with her new outfit, man. They ain't ready for Yorichi. They ain't ready, man. But let's keep it moving. Uh, we're, and the, the fact that we're that close to the point where we're going to be able to see Yorichi again, because she should appear in one of these episodes pretty soon. I, I don't know which one, but she should appear in one of these episodes pretty soon. So, this is going to be pretty nuts. And then on top of that, we're supposed to be getting Ichibe versus Yuha, which is going to be insane. Like, we're, we're overall, we're eating good out here. We are eating so good out here. Either way, we're still cooking. I mean, for an Ichigo that's this old, though, it's doing better than I expected it to. <laughs> I'll say that much. This Ichigo is doing a lot better than I expected it to do, uh, considering how old it is. <laughs> Alright, keeping it moving here. Done with that. This should be the last one before the boss room. Yeah, I just wish that that, that second strong tech, I really wish I had homing on it. If it did, it meant so much good. They've been so much better. Let me get back here. They, they try to pin me in here. And they didn't give it that much range. As you saw, that one that one hall literally rolled right past it. It doesn't have that much range either, but... Alright, let's keep that going. This is definitely not going to be my fastest clear time, obviously. I mean, this character's old as hell, but hey... He's still getting it done. That's all that matters. He's still getting it done, bro. This Ichigo is getting it done. Man, get out of here with that. Alright, boss room time. Soul bomb. Once again, we need a revamp of this Ichigo. We really do, but... Oh, he actually lit both soul bombs. Yeah, we still got it done. But, hey. That's pretty much it for this showcase of this Ichigo. No, not the best showcase of my ability, because I screwed up the first time, but hey. He got the drip, that's all that matters. But without further ado, that's pretty much going to be it for me. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and this is going to be Shinobi Eevee signing off. Let me know what you guys think of this Ichigo, or hell, what you think of Ichigo showing up in Thousand Year Blood War, and I'm going to get the hell out of here. Peace.